but he's my main one. So uh, yeah, you guys always want to meet my managers, my photographers. Well, here's Eddie. So, what are some questions you want to ask? People want to know how many years have you been doing photography? I've been doing this uh, this year. This I just went over 11 years. So I've been shooting Ooh. for 11 years now. Uh, basically, only models. Uh, rarely do I ever do landscape photography, or nature photography, or animal photography. It's always models. Uh, A person. So that's what I've worked all my editing and software to do. That's my main goal is to work with models, photos, not because there's different ways to edit different types of photos. So I've concentrated on that. And 11 years of experience, never saying I'm the best, always learning. Um, that's, when you, when you hear those photographers claim they're the best. No one's the best. They may be really good, but you can always be better. Yep. One more question before we move to the next spot, then we'll answer some more. People want to know, do you prefer indoor or outdoor and why? That's a good one. That's a really good one. I actually prefer outdoor because for the first five years, four or five years, I did all outdoor. So I learned all my lighting techniques, how to light a model with using natural light much better than what I've done indoor. Now, that being said, I've been doing indoor for the past five years as well. So I've got a good handle on that. Still lots to learn on lighting indoor, but I actually do prefer outdoor. Very cool. Very cool answer. Okay, we will do more along the way. Okay, everybody, back to questions. Take two. We were just asked a question by somebody coming by while you're doing photography. Where do you find your models, Eddie? Normally, I find them uh, through Model Mayhem. Dot com. Uh, a lot of the girls are also on Instagram now, are the models, and they advertise their being models. Uh, I work with a lot of travel models that travel all across the country, and as they pass through this area, if there's someone I want to work with, I hit them up, and we end up having to shoot. So, and then there's always those ones you see out working in Walmart, working at a gas station, yeah, nice. somewhere. Yeah, I got your and then model. you just know that they should be modeling. Yeah. So you ask them without trying to be creepy. And sometimes you find an unknown, sometimes not. <laughs> sometimes you're creepy and sometimes you're not. Okay, another question that's asked a whole lot of times. In Angel's videos, she has, but she's been in some magazines, but we see where you've had a lot of girls in a lot of magazines, even like yeah. big time magazines. So how do you go about submitting your photos, I guess? That's a, that's a tough one. Every magazine seems like they want photos submitted a different way. Some want them cropped to a certain specific size. Some want them without logo. Uh, normally it's, you find a magazine that you want to submit to, and then you go to their website, and they'll usually have instructions on how to submit the photos. So it's a matter of finding magazines that fit, because... Angel being alternative. Playboy is not taking you know? a model like this. Yeah. Not to say that she's not perfectly fit for being in Playboy, because she is, but it's the tattoos and the piercings, um, those type of magazines don't really want that. So you have to look more like magazines like Inked, um, there's a bunch of magazines that promote a lot of the uh, tattooed models. Well, we haven't even tried any of that lately. 
Anyway. One last thing before we move to spot number next and get more. Lots of people have noticed in your videos that Angel says you're retired military oh, and to it. say thank you for your service. Can you describe what you were in, which branch of military and how many years? Yeah, um, I was uh, in the Navy for almost 23 years. Uh, submarine service, strictly, so lots of time underwater. Uh, when I left, I left at the highest rank you can get in the Navy, Master Chief, E9 for those non-Navy people. Um, and uh, I've basically done a whole other career since then. I've been out that long. So, uh, yeah. That's, that's awesome. My, that's my name. Well, congratulations. And also, Angel even went to buy a vehicle and a man there recognized her from a magazine and you and knew you from the Navy and you hadn't seen him in what, about 20 years he said? Yep. Oh, yeah! So, he was our, the Ford place. He and was he our, said we could put it in there. He worked at Lynchburg Ford, which is Apple Ford now. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. I remember that now. Yeah, he was our... Uh, Hospital foreman. Uh, a while they, have, they have to have a hospital foreman on board the submarines. Uh, back in the old days, on the uh, fleet ballistic missile submarines, they actually required a doctor as well, which they've done away with. Uh, so now it's just hospital foreman, and they have to be pretty well versed in taking care of virtually anything because you don't have a doctor out there to take care of any missiles. Well, once again, thanks okay. so much for serving your time, and you do awesome. Um, <laughs> all of your girls, your photography rock, and, and you've got lots of fans. <laughs> Eddie Kiplinger, me photography. My mom's through. <laughs> <laughs> I actually hit the shutter. Okay. Mom's. Mom's through. Are you ready? So. One question for me, what is it like to work with angel fishes? Am I your favorite or am I not? Yes. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I had a cough. It's, it's been one hell of an experience. <laughs> I can uh, only imagine. I do a ton of nip slips. I do a ton enjoy of my Facebook posts. I feel like I've had a large part in training her uh, because those Good. of you who think modeling is just standing there and looking pretty? No. Totally wrong. So wrong. Really good models have That's to be it. able to do lots of things. Lighting. It's they all about the pose. They have to posing, the expressions. This uh, one's going to come down. About there's Florida. just <laughs> a ton of things that models do that the average person has no idea. So yeah. It's think, like, um, I love you, Tessa, and you'll probably watch my video, but Tessa even mentioned when she shot with you, and how stiff he said she looked, and how like she would just kind of go like this or this, or this, and it's like in photos you have to be like the superwoman pose. You have to pull your hair. You have to get in the water and stuff, and it's just kind of a lot to do, especially when the water's cold. See, it's beautiful, but it's cold. <laughs> so it's a lot into it, a lot more than you think, a lot of hours, but it's a lot of fun. Once again, Angel Vicious with Eddie Kiplinger, me photography. And I'm just going to get a little bit of shots of the water and the trees now real quick. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching my channel. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what kind of videos you guys want to see. And she has All a right. fans only page Oh yeah, too. I have an OnlyFans page. It's OnlyFans.com slash Angel Vicious. And if you join on the 4th of July, which is quite a bit away, you might want to join before then. It'll be $15 instead of $20. But $20 covers you for the whole month, as will it on the 4th of July. Anyways, that's about it. Okay, guys, here's some Follow scenery. Follow me on social media. This is actually Crabtree Falls. Crab Falls. Virginia. Virginia. This is not the falls, but. And it is 
so pretty out here. The scenery is awesome. Bye guys. See you. Okay, we are back. Angel Vicious and Eddie Kiplinger Me Photography. Um, Angel has a lot of fans that follow her. And a lot of them do what they call amateur for fun photography. What type of cameras do you use? And how long do they usually last? Or what would you recommend Good to one. people that want to know about cameras? If, if you're going to get serious about it uh the uh, what they call a dslr uh, type camera that's usually the best although their sony is coming out with uh, a mirrorless camera that is supposed to be pretty damn good wow. uh, you know if you're just having fun keep your cost minimal on the camera uh, don't go crazy I mean, I've got thousands of dollars spent on my camera equipment, but if you're just going to have fun with it, just get you a decent camera, read reviews. Like a Canon or a Nikon Set, set you a price range. Sony makes some great cameras. Nikon, Canon, uh, all great digital cameras. So uh, in, any one of them, but figure out a price range that you want to stay within, and then just start looking at each manufacturer's cameras. And look at ratings, look at uh, what other people say about them, and go from there. there Thank you, you very much. The camera I use as well is a video camera Canon. I got it from Best Buy, so if anybody wants to know that too. Actually, he got the same one. From Amazon. From Amazon. It's probably a little cheaper than mine, or more maybe. Who knows? I can't even remember what I paid for mine, but. I can't, I can't comment on video cameras. I do all still shots. Yeah. Uh, I, I may play with some video here in the future, but we did a little one as soon as he got his uh, video camera in. We did some at the lake. <laughs> that was pretty cool. And thank you guys. We'll continue later.